skivvy. <laughs> we're not getting ready. Don't okay, get your skivvies in a wrinkle. I just gotta throw some stuff in a bag and we're out of here. Yeah. All right. There's a lot more to it than that. Come on. Hey, let's go. All right, already. Water filter. Stove with fuel. First aid kit with band-aids, neosporin, aspirin, map. Where's my touch chart? Don't want to get stuck. This ought to fit and not be too heavy. No fire restrictions at this time. Rattlesnake Ridge Trail's open. Cool. Shouldn't you be packing? Bro, check out my new boots. You're gonna blow out your knees with all that weight. No way, that's why I pump iron. Besides, no reason not to bring the comforts of home. We'll be sharing a tent. No. You snore. Hey, Jeff. Hi, Emily. Taking off to Big Flat. Oh. Finally convinced him to do King Peak, huh? Yeah. We'll be gone four, maybe five days, if we get caught up by storms or tides. I wanted to let you know, just in case. Well, thanks for letting me know. Hi. What can I do for you? Nice digs. Thank you. We need a fire permit. We're hiking the Lost Coast Trail. Okay. This permit is issued for campfires and stoves. And where are you guys heading off to today? We're shooting for Big Flat. Nice. You know, there's three spots impassable at high tides. And you'll be crossing one of those stretches. Yeah, I saw it on the website. And I brought my tide chart. Oh, good. Also, lately there's been lots of bears getting into backpackers' food. Bears? Bears. You can rent bear canisters for $5 from the stores at the trailheads. You'll rent at one end and drop off at the other. That's okay. We'll just hang our food. Unfortunately, the bears have figured that out, and we would like to make sure that they do not get to know you or your food. Okay. All right. Thank you for coming in. Have a good time. Thanks a lot. Waves. I should have brought my board. Right. You don't even surf. So? Oh, that's cool. I got it. Um, Chad. What? That's poison oak. I say we set up camp before it gets too dark. My thoughts, exactly. This looks like a good spot. It's out of sight of the trail. It's already been used. I don't have to trample a new area. Yeah, we can just chill. Check out the superb vista all around us. <laughs> Picked a primo spot. Total quiet. There it is. Thanks. You guys sure know a good spot. Thanks. Hey, you guys mind if we camp here with you? Uh, 
Well, uh, that's well. a great idea. Hey, everybody, these guys just invite us to camp with them. Yeah, that's fun. I think we're safe. You know, I don't feel itchy at all. Let's see how you feel in about 48 hours. If you wash the oils off right away, you might get lucky. You want to cook or make the fire? Make the roaring fire. <laughs> make sure you only take the downed wood. Yeah, lucky you told me that, because I was just about to go chop down an old growth redwood tree. And keep it small. Uh, Jeff. Duh. Uh-huh. I'll bite. Oh, oh! What fire! Is that? Fire! Fire! No. Oh. Fire! Oh. 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 Put it out! Give me one! Gotta be dead out. Or space cases like you will burn the whole forest down. I got it. Good thing I brought the soda. Good one, Ranger Chad. Now the soda's gonna attract bears. Let me show you how it's done. That looks like a good spot right there. No way, man. It's better to use an existing pit and clear the area around it. I'll get some wood. Small chunks? Oh. Totally dry. Excellent. No raging rookie fires for these cowboys, huh? This is what I call living large. Beats watching TV, that's for sure. Well, I may hit it. Yeah, big day tomorrow.